Well, Disney Plus says it hit 10 million subscribers just 24 hours after launching yesterday. And today, many Siouxlanders are getting their Disney fix online after joining that streaming service. KCAU 9's Jessica Watson joins us with more on the future of television. Jessica? Bridget, today many people cho chose to watch choose to watch all their TV through streaming services. But now, with so many streaming choices, many Siouxlanders say it's hard to pick where to spend their money. There's no way everyone can subscribe to everything. Isaiah Munson lives in Sioux City and got Disney Plus Tuesday. He says he has to make deals with his family in order to pay for his online shows. My mom and dad didn't want to get the subscription, so they said, you know, if you want it that bad, you're going to have to get it. So we kind of worked out a deal where they do the Netflix, uh, my dad does the Hulu and then I do the Disney Plus. I looked up the most basic plans for Hulu, Netflix, and Disney Plus. Together, all these services will cost at least $25 a month. We have to keep aware of that um, and make sure that we're prepared uh, going forward. The Northeast Nebraska Telephone Company says streaming services have greatly changed the way their company operates. In five years, we probably won't sell many telephone customers and we probably won't sell many uh, cable TV customers like we do today and we'll just sell a big fat internet pipe and customers will buy their services through that pipe however they choose to. The company now focused on providing the highest speed internet possible needed for the constant streaming services. Traditional cable is somewhat going away and people are starting to use more streaming services all the time. I personally only use uh Netflix, and then uh, whenever I need to look at the news, that's the only real time I ever use cable or direct TV. We want to know what you think. Let us know if you still prefer cable or online streaming. We have a poll on our website that is SiouxlandProud.com. Jessica Watson, KCAU 9 News. All right, thank you for that, Jessica.